Good afternoon. I'm Dave Percy at the National Weather Service with Alaska Statewide Weather. Strong offshore flow continued to blow across southeast Alaska and was colliding with a warmer, more moist air mass sliding up from the Pacific. Light snow was occurring across the southern panhandle with gusty northeast winds of 40 to 60 miles per hour continuing to blow through the passes to the north. Mainland Alaska was mostly fair with light winds and cold temperatures as low as the mid minus 30s across the Yukon Flats. Areas of fog developed over Cook Inlet and locally the Knick Arm areas and persisted into the afternoon across Anchorage. A few flurries with a weak trough were observed along the western Arctic coast. This area will spread east and southeast to the Brooks Range tonight with some improving conditions along the central and western coast toward morning. Gale force winds are out for the western Aleutians as a frontal system moves in toward that area from the southwest. And there's a chance of rain and snow tonight across Kodiak Island. Look for rain to push in and become heavy at times across the southern panhandle with a mixture of rain or snow across the central areas. Most of northern southeast Alaska will remain dry, but we'll see an increase in the clouds and a general warming of temperatures. For Tuesday, look for periods of rain, heavy at times across the southern southeast coast with warmer temperatures pushing northward. There'll be an area of mixed precipitation over this north central panhandle with a chance of snow over the north areas from Lynn Canal along the Klondike Highway to Skagway in the afternoon. Otherwise, the North Gulf Coast should remain dry most of the day with increasing clouds. There's a chance of rain and snow along the southern Kenai Peninsula with snow changing to rain across Kodiak Island. For Wednesday, Bristol Bay will see areas of light rain or snow with some light snow across the Kusukum Delta to Nunavak Island and possibly extending southward to the eastern Aleutians. Strong high pressure over the Northwest Territories will keep most of mainland Alaska cold and dry with a few variable clouds moving across the north central areas. Another warm front will push uh, mixed precipitation over the south central part of the panhandle with rain across Prince of Wales Island over to Metlakatla. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Dave Percy.